Did you get some weight, especially during Christmas holiday? Did you overeat and now you can fix in your favorite pair of jeans? Don't worry, Elastin is going to save you. What is Elastin? Why is it being used worldwide in the last 40 years? Is it natural rubber or synthetic? In this video, I will try to answer all of these questions. Let's see that together. Elastan is a fantastic fiber that has been used so far for its features. It can double, triple or quadruple its length. It's used especially for trousers, beachwear, sportswear, all ready to garments in general because it gives elasticity to your fabric. In the 60s, if you had a pair of jeans made of 100% cotton, you had to change your jeans if you got some 4 or 5 kilos more. Fortunately, nowadays, if you get some weight, you don't have to change your jeans. Elastan can be mixed with several fibers and has replaced the natural rubber, which has been used for years in clothing. Watch out guys, because natural rubber is still used in clothing, but it crumbles and dries out during the time. A lot of people think that Elastan is natural rubber or synthetic rubber, but it's not like this. Let's give some order. There is rubber, natural or synthetic, so polyisoprene. Then there is polyurethane. Elastodine, elastomultiesters, elastoolefin, and so on, so on. There are a number of different polymers. The most used is naturally elastan, that according to the European regulation is 85% polyurethane based, which is the same polymer used for foams, insulation, plastic, and TPU, and several other fields. Lycra is a type of elastan very much used for tights, hosiery, especially women's garments. But Lycra is indeed Elastan or Elastomultiester. You have to keep in mind that Lycra, Elaspam, Spandex, Elaspan, Roika, Dorlastan and Radici Spandex are all copyrights and these articles are indeed produced by that company. The base is normally the same, Elastomultiester or Elastan. These are all different types of Elastan with different prices and different performances. Elastan can be produced by dry spinning, wet spinning or melt spinning, depends on the type of Elastan. The yarn count is always 11 DTEX or multiple of 11 because this is due to the spinneret during the extrusion and the spinneret size is always standardized. Elastan is fantastic for your garments guys but it has a one big problem, it cannot be dyed. It can be mass dyed like polypropylene but you won't find blue or white elastan worldwide. You will see something like white elastan, black elastan but normally it's transparent. Since elastan cannot be dyed, elastan is always covered but we will see that in another video. Can I write in the care label 90% cotton and 10% lycra? No, you cannot write it since Lycra is a copyright. You can write 90% cotton and 10% Elastan in the brackets Lycra. Can I recycle Elastan? This is a very tough question indeed. The answer is yes, Yosung, I guess, tried to do that, but the result is not so good. I mean, recycled Elastan can be performed, but the mechanical features are not so good and the ultimate tensile strength is very less less compared to virgin or raw Elastan. That's it for today guys, I hope you have enjoyed the video and the content of this video naturally, you will find my details below and as usual, if you have any kind of questions, I am disposal naturally, so yeah, as usual, stay safe, take care, I'll see you guys in the next video.